Ironwood Games. This is Andrew. And today I'm going to uh, try out uh, Hammerwatch. Uh, so I haven't played this yet. Um, well, let's just jump right in and see what we get. All right. So let's start with the uh, first campaign, not the expansion. Uh, fight your way through Castle Hammerwatch to get the treasure. Um, all right, I clicked it, and I guess that's it. The bridge. All right. See if you can find a way out. We'll wait here. All right, so... Uh, I have no idea. Uh, I know how to move around, I guess. All right, let's see. If I can... figure out how to... Um, attack things. All right, this is not great. Got these bats chasing me, and I'm just gonna die. Well, <laughs> just gonna mash at some keys here and see if I can find anything that seems like an attack. I probably should go just look at some bindings. Um, that gives me some chat. So enter opens my chat. Uh, you know, as expected, WASD uh, moves me around. All right, so let's go to options, controls, rebind. All right, uh, so we gave up on trying to figure that out. Uh, so attack, it looks like is up. So it uses the arrows as well uh, for the attack. Left, right, and down, and then potion uh, for F and tab for the map. Okay, let's resume. Ah, uh, there we go, okay. So do I have, okay, I have a stash is my one skill. I don't know if I have another skill here. Okay, and so we uh, had some fun getting that figured out. That's, all right, so tab they said was the map. Okay, and so I can uh, run around Cool. With the map on, the map shows enemies, it looks like. All right. Okay, so I can slash some stuff. This is uh, not bad. So let's see if we can figure out what are kind of objective is, or what we're doing. I guess we're just kind of wandering around the castle. And killing things right now. Um, so these bugs love to just hang out. And then they kind of wake up. Okay, let's go see, uh, get an apple. That will heal me. Okay. Um, all right, so there's definitely uh, some stairs down there. Looks like maybe a safe point over here. Uh, I'm guessing is what the floppy disk uh, picture represents. All right. And we're just kind of wandering around, picking up treasure, killing some things. I'm gonna guess those uh, keys um, and the runes and things up top are... All right, so we opened a passage and a bunch of bats came out after us. Awesome. around up 
here a little bit. Okay, so I think this was the Paladin character that it was on. Um, when we uh, prematurely clicked and just jumped in. And that's fine. This probably suits my uh, style pretty well. I just want to kind of uh, get up in their face and slash them. I don't want to try and... Or I'm not really going to try and... Uh, clever and had enough trouble figuring out how to attack uh, to try and worry about making some ranged attacks work or some other type of... Alright, so we got a key. So that, I assume, is going to open a door somewhere and be good for us. Alright, just finishing off collecting all this stuff. I don't know if it says anywhere how much gold we have. Um, so looks like there's another door over there, but we're at the end of this passageway here. I do like the map um, feature. Okay, so that's a checkpoint. Not sure what activating it does, other than if we die, we can restart there, I guess, instead of back at the beginning of the level. Uh, we're going to try not to die anymore, though, now that we know how to do some things. Of course, we need to hit these guys head on, otherwise they come and attack us from the side. Alright, there we go. So that's fine, doing good here. I imagine this is just, since it's just the first level, uh, the enemies are going to get tougher and probably need some, a little bit more strike. Look, like there's some maggot, maggoty things over there. That's interesting. Okay. Uh, so I like it so far. Just kind of let them come to me. Um, oh, that's a bomb. Okay, got to be careful about that. That's a bomb. Is what that flashing thing was. Not something to pick up, but something to kill me. All right. So the only thing that I don't like is you can't, as far as I can tell, you can't move the map um, around independently. It just kind of centers on where you're at. Uh, which is fine, just means we have to kind of remember uh, more or less our orientation, because we can see just the area right around us. Alright, I got a vendor coin. That seems good. Big coin. idea. It seems like there's a other side over there. And maybe we should get there. Um, but I don't know. All right. Got some bats down here. I assume we'll use these coins for something, maybe between levels or somewhere there'll be a little... Okay, these guys shoot acid, so that's not good. Okay, oh, and they poison you, it looks like. Okay, so I get some delayed poison effects. I'm definitely... A little bit more dead than I'd like to be. No, 
for thought. I get that we're in a kind of dark castle with the the lamps. I just I am personally am not a fan of kind of dark uh, textures and not really being able to to see well. It's not like the worst. It just it personally frustrates me when I kind of can't see what's there. And I don't know if it's uh, the images. My monitor is a little uh, dirty. Um, as well, so I can't tell if that's also contributing to it. Okay, we've got another key. Okay. Um, let's go back around to this area over here. Uh, that I didn't explore. Or finish exploring, I guess. Try and kill those worms. They are brutal. Uh, since the apples are red and give me health, I'm guessing those blue crystals would give me uh, mana or spell power or whatever the... Uh... Okay, so this one I can go through. It's interesting. We looped back around. Okay, there's a checkpoint there. I don't know that I want to activate it yet, but I don't know that waiting does anything. I'm just kind of curious to see what's around here. As I think it's just a respawn point. Oh. So I saw some... Uh, eyes down here and it turned out to be some kind of a hidden passage and then we found a mysterious plank so I have no idea okay it looks like there might be maybe a merchant or somebody over there looks like an interesting fellow okay we got another one of these coins Ugh. I got hit with the bomb again. All right. Let's pick up the rest of these coins. Um, it looks like we've kind of mapped everything out here. All right. So let's hit this uh, checkpoint before I forget about it. Yeah, I don't know if those keys will let us through this gate or not. No, it looks like we have to find another way around. Ooh, there's a shiny key. Oh, these keys open these bronze barriers. Okay. Because we already, because we're down, now we're out of keys. We had already opened one. And we are so close to being dead. Let's go talk to that merchant man. I say, as I walk away from him um, to do other things. All right. Um, all right, so down. Hey, strange planks are scattered around the castle. Make sure not to miss any of them. Okay, so we did find a strange plank over there that he's telling us are scattered around, so... I have no idea how to know if we've missed any or not. Hopefully that's our first one and we haven't missed any. Um, those guys are gonna kill us very quickly here. Uh, okay, because we are at uh, all of five health. Okay, there is a uh, stairway over there. We need another bronze key. Let's see. 
I'm not sure what the star represents. Uh, but it tells us it's that way. Turned out this guy down here was not a merchant, just a secret keeper. Okay, I just want to grab an apple before I fight these guys. Okay, getting a little better. It's kind of wandering around. This is where I'm saying it's kind of hard. I can't see in that dark corridor up there. All right. So we need a key to go over there. I definitely want a bronze key. There's a nice gold coin over there. Alright, I don't mind fighting these guys. They're manageable. I just kind of hit them. Alright, there's a bronze key. So that's good. The other question I guess I have, or to find out, is if there's like a shortage of keys. Okay, so that will go up to um, another. Exiting a floor also saves your game the same way waypoints do. All right, so it looks like these are little hint boxes. All right, so I could go up another floor right now, but I do have this key that we know will open this one here, which I think... Little, maybe it doesn't lead over there. Maybe it just leads to some food and some bats. So maybe it's not worth it. Okay, I think if I stay head on with these guys, my shield will absorb the acid. Um, which seems to be pretty good. Alright, so let's pick up another key. Oh, there's some arrows shooting there. That's what I got hit from. Okay. Some kind of defensive traps. Gain some more health up. Let's see what this hints at. Vendor coins give you a price reduction at vendors. It can be seen down right in the vendor panel. Okay. So I'm hoping this star is a vendor. Yeah, those arrows, we might need to time better. There are several stores in the game. Some are hidden and some are easy to find. Use these to upgrade your hero. All right, so assuming this is... Um, a store here. Uh, he offers combo. Killing 10 enemies in quick succession triggers a combo which increases move, and sp move speed and damage for a short while. Okay, so I've got three vendor coins. It's giving me a discount here. I see that. Um, I have 924 coins and this will cost 246. So let's take combo. Oh wow, okay, and then there's uh, more levels of this. So I can increase the combo timer, make it easier to chain combos by increasing the combo timer. Uh, combo Nova shoots a six part Nova that does 12 damage while a combo is interesting. It is active, so that's interesting. Um, Combo healing heals for two s per second while a combo is active, and then regenerate mana on that. So, a Nova and the healing would be interesting. The timer, like these first three, since I don't do any uh, spell casting right now, at least I don't know if that one would be interesting. Um, all right, we're a little oops, light on the cash to make that work. Okay, and we got through there. So yeah, the star guy must be at uh, the store. Alright, so let's pick up some more coins. Is there no way through there? Okay, that guy's interesting. Um, or maybe there are different kinds of stores. Maybe the star is the combo store. I don't know. All right. So again, I don't know how to get uh, over there. It looks like I might have to come down from the second level.
Yeah, so again, not being able to kind of move the map around, or at least not having figured that out, is annoying, but something we can work around. Um, let's see, where was this? All right, so let's go up. Floor 2, Prison Act 1. Okay, they're going to shoot through the wall, so let's go there. All right, so we had that bronze key we carried over with us. Hey, yeah, yeah, this guy's got spikes. Oh my goodness, I'm going to die. Yeah, they do get pretty tough here. Pretty serious, pretty quick. shoot through those grates. Oh, I got my combo on. That's cool. Okay. Just brutal. Oh my goodness, that looks like a huge bug over there. Oh man. And I am so close to death. I don't know if my uh, sword has my attack has gotten stronger. I wasn't paying enough attention, I guess. Somehow I missed a bronze key over there. Okay, in all the panic of being attacked. Okay, so I went around that whole thing. Now we can come down here. All right, we are managing. Oh, oh, bomb. All right, game over. So let's look at my statistics. Damage done. Enemies killed. Damage taken. Quite a bit. Uh, deaths. So I did have those early deaths. Um, which uh, didn't help this run, I guess. Um, distance moved. Breakables destroyed. Mana used. And my score. Alright. And it was a 20 minute run. All right, so there we go. That was my first run of Hammer Watch. We died a couple of times because we didn't know how to attack. Let's go back here. Um, just to see, I can change. Uh, we kind of clicked the, the level real quick. We didn't see this. So we've got Range Spellcaster. Uh, we've got the Ranger Versatile Fighter with Long Range, recommended for new players. Melee Spellcaster, who can replenish health. High damage melee fighter with low defense. Uh, priest, range spellcaster with good defense who can heal. A sorcerer. And then the paladin. So that's interesting. I would definitely see how this could be uh, doing the... There's a multiplayer. Um, options and kind of forming a party with some of your different characters uh, would be interesting. Um... We can also change the difficulty. Um, help and info. This might have been important to read. All right, character progression. In Hammerwatch, you buy new skills and ability using money at specialized vendors around the game. You will also find small upgrades when killing bosses and inside secrets. These will increase one of your basic stats, damage, armor, health, or mana. Okay. Yeah, it has the controls, so that would have been awesome to know.
Okay. Oh, I guess if we have, you can hold down L control to toggle auto fire if we're doing uh, a ranged thing. All right. And then we have the heroes. Items. Use keys to open doors. Golden keys are the most rare. All right. Money is used to purchase. Food replenishes. Yeah, these blue ones were mana. And then potions. Um, upgrades. Rarely will find an upgrade and permanently upgrades your damage, armor, health, or mana pool. Extra lives gives you more chances. There are three uh, different. One up, five up, and seven up. Awesome. Uh, chests. I don't know if we found any. Strange blinks. Like this one are used for bridge building. Okay, so I found that plank. I don't know how many you need to build the bridge. We did have that group at the beginning that was we got separated from. All right, so then there are different types of vendors. The offense, a vitality combo, defense, and then power up. Okay, so different kinds of vendors. Interesting, and then load your progression. So it does save uh, where we were at, we could load. Um, looks like back to level two. Yeah. Okay. So that's interesting. Um, so you could play through, and you're not completely out. You don't have to start over. Interesting that there was that key there later, but I don't see it right now. Maybe I somehow activated a switch or something that opened it. Um, so it might be worthwhile to start over on the first level. Um, just because I had lost two of my lives. I don't know if there's somewhere that tracks my lives or not. Um, the poison is, is frustrating because it slows me as well. the tank if the paladin's supposed to be more tanky or not yeah and now this key is not showing up here so I have no idea uh, where it came from uh, we could I suppose go back down and talk to that vendor again Um, and upgrade our combo further. I don't know how scarce um, and precious kind of the coins are. Um, if it's worth, if you can really just upgrade everything or if it needs to be uh, kind of judicious because um, I don't know how much the combo is I guess that's my combo bar at the bottom I saw it kind of filling up there all right and quit um, so yeah so it's interesting um, I think we'll end here uh, thanks for joining me on this uh, episode of hammer watch I might try it again with some of the other characters um, otherwise, check out some of our other videos. Uh, please uh, subscribe if you like what you see. And uh, feel free to leave us any comments, anything you'd like us to, uh, to try out um, or do. All right, until next time.